After years of waiting for his judgment to be fulfilled by the state of Grenada, Grandan's businessman, Dorset Charles, is finally getting some of the cash owed to him. This was Mr. Charles in 2020 as he explained to the media that he had become destitute. <laughs> I depend on my kids in Canada. A 1990 judgment order by the Court of Appeal was first made in the favor of Dorset Charles at over $1.6 million for damage to his property. 22 years after, the local court ruled that Prime Minister Dr. Keith Mitchell and his ruling New National Party government had acted illegally in bulldozing the water sports business of Dorset Charles and Grandan's Beach. The small businessman is finally due to get a settlement payment of EC $2.2 million. Attorney at law Ansem Clouden, who represents Charles, addressed the media on Friday. Well, I must say, we have since had a, a new attorney general. And notwithstanding all the objections by the government to the application for leave, which we succeeded in getting, the Current Attorney General, recognizing that on the 31st of March, it could result in a very, very indecent embarrassment, an indecent embarrassment for the government. So we entered into negotiations since March 31st. Just, we appeared in court, and uh, it, uh, the, 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 the presiding judge was advised that a consent order would be forthcoming. And we have reached an agreement. Crowden says an initial payment of 60000 has been made to Dorset Charles, which is scheduled for the payment of the full amount. The writ is just there held in abeyance. If there is any further default, we are going to go right back to the court and tell the court, look, the government has reneged on its undertaking, its promise, and we would have to seek an execution of the writ of mandamus. I am Jared Joseph for GBN News.